Hi and welcome back to the Wigan Athletic YouTube channel and here we are today in association with Tix Gaming. Yes, what have you been doing if you haven't seen us already? My name is James, this is Presec, but also Wigan Athletic. Comments down below, if you've been seeing what we've been doing, comments. And don't forget, smash those thumbs and look in the description down below to my own content over at the Presec channel. But the main thing you've got to do is get over and support Tix Gaming. Come on, boys and girls. Let's like, subscribe and get notified to future uploads from the Wigan Athletic YouTube channel. Because what else would you be doing? Having a look at my uh, youth intake in a minute? Hmm... Yes, yeah, so I had a few people asking me, we never seem to see your youth intake. Yeah. Here we are again. Average intake. Apparently, four A-rated players. A central midfielder, an attacking midfielder, a couple of wingers, and a striker. If they all come in, happy days. But looking at the rest of it, E's, E's, F's, and not even rated. You can see why they're saying average intake. But... We're going to zip on from here because this was just purely to show you what was going on because we've got a bit of transfer window coming up. And here we are on the 31st of December. Now, the FIFA best men's player. Makoko coming in second behind Mbappe. Absolutely fantastic stuff. And Lukaku apparently third. Yeah. Then the world player of the year. Same three. Mbappe, Makoko and Romelu Lukaku. Risky. He has won the Copper Trophy, which is Celtics... which is the UEFA Champions League voters trophy. So that's something to be happy about. He's played 32 appearances for them so far this season, scoring 25 goals. I think we might have to get him back. De Gea wins Golden Gloves. And there, right behind him, Courtois. Of course he has. Absolutely stunning stuff. De Gea, we will praise him because he did win Goalkeeper of the Year as well. Shake his hand. He's really positive. FIFA Pro Team of the Year. Makoko is in up top. Zanyu in his defender as well. And De Gea in goal. Absolutely fantastic stuff. Risky wins Golden Boy as well. European Golden Boy. That is a marvellous award. Livramento, Player of the Year for England. We'll congratulate him on that as well. Mbappe wins the French Player of the Year. Risky comes in second. Shaughnessy, Irish Player of the Year. We'll congratulate him on that as well. And Shaughnessy wins the Young Player of the Year as well. So it's fantastic stuff. But again, we're going to scoot on another couple of days just to get us up to where we said we'd come back. So here we are back in on the 1st of January. Only a day, purely because we've done a bit of business. And we said we're not going to go on a spending spree. We've been offering strange players that aren't got any stars. I'm not sure what Gregor's up to, but don't need these sort of players. But Thibaut Courtois, oh my goodness me, an A- minus from the fans. Absolutely loving it. Send him on a language course. We'll get De Gea to praise him and welcome him in board. Unfortunately, that means De Gea won't be playing, but <laughs> that's not my problem now. But we're going to be looking at things. We're going to hopefully get some more players sorted. But Makoko wins player of the month. With Zanyu coming in third, we've also got Mara as young player of the year because he's been playing a lot of football lately. So it's great news. But what we want to do now, we're probably going to bring back some of the players on loan just to get the squad bolstered back out. And we've got a few days and we're coming back to play Arsenal. And we'll show you how we've got on in the in-betweeny bits. Yes, yeah, here we are a couple of days on. One big problem, Sam Surridge. I wanted to bring him back. We can't bring him back. We cannot terminate his loan. I don't know why. Bit of a mishap on my part somehow, maybe. But Morad Risky is back. But we want to get him back off that loan list. He is not for loan ever again. And hopefully John Scott will be sold. But what have we done transfers so far? We're trying to bring in Gavin Bazuna. But we'll have to wait and see on that. Thibaut Quartar has come in for £7 million. Six up front. And... No one else out at the moment, so we'll have to wait and see how we get on in January. But looking at the old squad balance and stuff, 
Thibaut Courtois has come in above De Gea, and I don't think we really need anyone, really. <laughs> we'll have to wait and see, but I think we're looking pretty strong, especially bringing Risky back in, who comes in as the third best striker now, which is fantastic news. And the second best winger on that left-hand side. Oh, yes. So after that draw against Manchester United, we went on a lovely bit of form, beating Fulham 3-2. Yeah, Gavi having his cracking goal in this game. Leeds United, 4-0 victory. Then it was Nottingham Forest, 4-0 victory again. Absolutely flying now. Then, come off the wheels a little bit, West Ham a one all draw. Southampton, 3-0 victory. And then away at Spurs. And not very good. We only went and lost to Spursy Spurs. And that brings us on today for the EFL Cup semi-final against Arsenal, first of all. And then sandwiched in between that is Bristol City in the FA Cup. And then Arsenal again. So a few nice tasty games today, taking us up to PSG, I would think. Maybe even Spurs, maybe do the revenge job on them. So let's go and play Arsenal. Here we go with Arsenal. Team today, Thibaut Courtois in goal. Livramento, Anel, Zanyu, Sardinia, Shaughnessy, De Gouvier, Mara, Risky, Hadrea and Makoko up top. So we've got the Wonder Kids all in and we'll have to see how we can do. I was thinking as well, maybe bringing his role back slightly to support and probably the same with Livramento. Just to be a little bit more cautious if you like. You'll notice that Gavi's on the bench. A little bit unfit. First leg against Arsenal. Arsenal have won four at the last five. But we've got the quality to beat them. Pump the fists. Let's go and do it today. Here we are at the Emirates Stadium. Time to put Arsenal to the sword. Hopefully. It's going to be a tricky one, whatever happens. But I'm hoping for a decent, decent win today. Just to sort things out for that second leg. We have got a bit of a FA Cup game in between. Only Bristol City. But you've got to beat these teams that's what's happening at the end of the day. We've had three shots so far. Arsenal have had nothing. Zanyu all the way back to Courtois, who apparently doesn't speak English. I'm sure he was for Chelsea for ages. So I'm not quite sure what's going on there. De Gouvier picks up the loose ball. Zanyu. 2 and L. Back to Zanyu. De Gouvier. Lovely football by Wigan. Sardinia. Here we go. Risky. Back in... The the moments with Wigan, Makoko losing the ball. If I could sell him in January, I would. I tell you, Martinelli, Courtois makes the save. I thought he blasted it straight over, but apparently it was a save. Odegaard now with the corner. A well by Anel. Smith Rowe to Odegaard. This isn't what we like to see. Saka. Oh, trying to bend it top corner, but no such luck. Now, Courtois again, left-footed, pumps the ball forward. Benton Kerr playing for Arsenal. Who would have seen that coming? Martinelli again in, but Courtois, as that world-class goalkeeper, makes the save. Lovely stuff. Odegaard again, whips it in far post, but it is away. 20 minutes gone, a shout of encourage. Come on, boys. We, we had the opening three shots. Arsenal at the time had nothing. They've now had six. They're starting to turn the screw a little bit. But can we get back on to it? Risky. Beats Saka to the ball. Goes down that left-hand side. Cuts inside to Degouvier. Makoko. And that is the problem with Makoko at the moment. When we need him to score, he's not doing it. De Gouvier to the far post. But will De Gouvier get there? No, look like he was running in treacle then. Hadrea and Makoko not having their best of days out there. A shout of fire up with 10 minutes to go. That has motivated some of the boys. Liveramento now to Hadrea. Hadrea just gives the ball away to Conrad. It's through to Saka. Saka through on goal. Turns back inside, but we win the ball back. Risky again to Makoko. Trying to get that ball through to Hadrea, but not happening. Not happening. 
At least Risky's having a little bit of a good game. It's not commentator's nightmare. Of course he's going to give the ball away and it's going to cost us a goal, in it? <laughs> Why did I say he's having a good game? Of course that was going to cost us. Oh, my days. <sighs> a shout of demand more. Five minutes to go in this half. Not good enough, but it has fired the boys up. Come on, lads. Half time is here. Terrible. Sort yourselves out. 1-0 down. Shaughnessy's been booked. I tell you what, we can take them all off. All the boys up top. Nalapo, off you come. Makoko, off you come for Adam Ida. Mara on that right hand side. Odegaard now with the ball in. Saka. <sighs> My goodness me. Have we got anybody playing on the right hand side? Gavi can switch. Oof. Smith Rowe. Now. De Gouvier and Gavi switch. Right. An L. Nods it to Conrad. Don't go two down. Quartar again. Meant to be world class. Hold it, son. Hold the ball. Let's go to a positive mentality and a shout of encourage. Conrad is all over the place at the moment. Ellison, it said we can make another substitution. Can we? I don't think so, somehow. Conrad's in again. And as I was saying, Conrad de la Flutiere has made it 2-0. That is a... I can't even make a beration. I want to make a beration. Come on, boys. 20 minutes to go. We need to up the game here. See, now it's going to be too late for beration, but we'll do it. It has fired the boys up. If we can get one back, that might just help before we go home to Arsenal. 10 minutes to go. This is just a bit of a wet lettuce of a game today. Makoko didn't come off. What happened there? Because he's on a 6.1. I don't get it. Well, far from pleased with that result. Let's go and batter some goals through Bristol City. Well, there might only be a couple of days, but we are going to go for it. It's it might be Bristol City, but we need to start getting this team to play itself into form. Quarter and goal. Livramento, Zanyu, Anel, Sardinia. Shaughnessy at the base. Yes, we've gone back narrow. Gavi, de Gouvier, Chiumeni, Ida and Hadrea up top. We're going a bit different. Coco's dropped. I want us to improve on our recent performance. Get out there and end this bad run. That has motivated the boys. And here we are at Ashton Gate. My goodness me. This is a place we haven't been in a long, long time. And hopefully means that we'll be able to put on a bit of a performance today. Because we have not been good of late. We need to turn this form around. And hopefully that will start today. Right. Frank Lampard in charge of Bristol City. Just spotted that there then. Crazy, crazy times. 20 minutes gone. A shout of encourage. Come on, boys. This is again... <sighs> Lackluster. Lackluster performance. We do need a bit of a shake-up. Whether it's a change of formation again to something... Maybe a 4 2 3 one I don't know, it's just, there's a lot going on. Sardinia, Hadrea, Chiumeni, to Gavi. We did have comments about Gavi saying he will play himself into form. He is new. Oh my goodness, what's the goalkeeper doing? A little extra Ziggy roll. He's called Ziggy. Um, he's new to the club. And I think we are expecting too much from Gavi. He is, like I said, He's only been in the country a little while. Doesn't know the language. It's fair. It's a fair shout. And there he is on 6.5. Maybe we're a little bit hasty with him. I don't know. It's <laughs> it's a tricky one. And there it is, half time. Throw the water ball. Totally unacceptable. 
sometimes you just got to do it. Just got to lay into the boys, Anel, to Gavi, Germany, Ida, Adrea, Santos to Gouvier, and Ziggy is pulling stardust out of the sky. <laughs> oh, God. Oh, sorry. Shaughnessy. Out to Sid. Highlight finished. Oh, I tell you sometimes. Oh. Right. Zanyu. De Gouvier. Shaughnessy. Hadrea. Ida. De Gouvier. Back to Hadrea. And finally, the deadlock is broken. Jim. Yes, well... So it should be, boys and girls. My goodness me, what a team we're playing. Santos de Gouvier, Shaughnessy, Hadrea, Ida. What lovely one-touch football. And there it is. Yes, I think when you say what a team we're playing, as in the team that's out on the pitch, not the fact that we're playing Bristol City. Although maybe Jim does mean that. I don't know. Anel, Courtois, forward. Adam Ida under it. He will win the ball. Of course he will. The big boy there he is. Adrea's in. And it's nearly two in a minute. That would have been great stuff. Oh, who was that? That was Santos de Gouvier over there doing a bit of a fist pump. Gavi now. Right. Time to make some changes, I think. Three changes made. De Gouvier, Shaughnessy and Ida off. Nicholas, Mara and Oterio on. Here we go. Let's see the rest of this game through and hopefully maybe score a few more goals. And we have changed the formation, gone to a 4-2-3-1 just to try it out for half an hour. And it's Gavi on the ball. In. Oh my goodness me. And now what a header. Jim. Absolutely beautiful delivery by Gavi. What a peach of a cross. Straight onto Anel's head. Boom, thank you. Boom indeed, Jim. Absolutely fantastic stuff. That is more like it. I think we will praise the boys. Let's try and get them round on side. They are pleased. They are motivated. That is great, great stuff. Come on. Mara now with the corner. Headband and all hits the post. My goodness me, that is unreal. We're turning the screw now. 11 shots, 9 on target. Thibaut Quartar forward. Loses the ball though. We do get it back. Gavi, he's having more fun now. Gavi, running. Gavi. Oh, Ziggy Stardust is there again. 10 minutes to go. This is more like it, though. But then we should be beating this lot by more to be more comfortable. A couple of minutes left, and it will be a handsome 2-0 victory in the FA Cup. And Nell's picked up a late booking. And there is one more highlight. But will it mean anything? Livermento back to Courtois. What's he going to do? Pumps the ball forward again. Gavi's there. Gavi down that left-hand side. Puts it back into Mara. What a shot that was. But unfortunately, that is it. But 2-0. Good work. That's better. Well, the fourth round of the FA Cup's just been drawn. We're away to Sutton United. Sutton United, who play in the Vanarama National League. With a stadium, I think, of like, what is it? 2,000. Look at it. That's going to be, hmm, rather fun. Here we go for the second leg against Arsenal. We're going to put De Gea in goal, actually. De Gea in goal. Livramento, Zanyu, Anel, Sardinia, Lizau at the base. Gavi, De Gouvier, Chumeni, Risky and Hadrea up top. Should be an interesting one today. Hopefully, without Sean see you suspended. <sighs> yes. Pick up where you left off last time out. Come on, boys. Here we are at the DW. Let's go. Fingers crossed, anyway. This should be a day where we can relax, enjoy ourselves, and get to a final of the Carabao Cup. Yes, it would be nice to get in it again. Get another trophy for Wigan. Absolutely fantastic stuff, if we can. A shout of encourage. Leazal there. 
a little bit uh, apprehensive, Anel, to Liazel. Zanyu, Gavi, to Gouvier, Risky, Hadrea, Hadrea! Oh, that was a great opportunity. Yeah, Risky's coming in as a complete forward on support rather than attack. Just trying to get him involved a bit if we can and see how he does. But as it stands at the moment, this is uh, not exactly how we was anticipating things. A shout of encourage again. They've had a couple bookings. Liazal been booked for us. Livermanto now to Liazal. To Gouvier. Risky. Picking up the ball. Trying to thread a little ball in, but it didn't work. Ball's pumped forward. Surely we got that. No, Skamaka did get it. Anel, Zanyu, Livermanto, back to Zanyu. Anel now, Zanyu. Lovely football. De Gea pings it out to Sardinia. Where's he going? He's thinking about it. Anel, don't think too long. Gavi, forward, forward, forward ball. De Gouvier's in. Hadrea's pass, beautiful. De Gouvier trots out to pick up that ball to take the corner. Now, ball in. Hadrea picks up the loose ball, gives it back to Santos de Gouvier. Too many. In. Risky. No. Oh, and Livermento's been done by Martinelli. That's not ideal, but Livermento does get back. Thankfully. Coming up to half time. Nil nil. 2 0 down from the first leg. Oh, that could have been three. I think we do need to up the tempo a fair bit. Focus through the middle. Come on, boys. We were trying to focus down that left-hand side, but it obviously it wasn't working. And half-time is here. Show me something else in the second half. Right. Come on. Risky not having his best out there today. We tried him. It's difficult. He's been playing up in Scotland. Obviously banging goals in for fun. But he's not doing it here. Right. Makoko, on you come, son. Show us something different. Show us that you can actually do something for us for a change. Because you have been dreadful. Makoko with the ball. Gavi. Livermento, one away from a yellow card. We're not interested in that sort of thing. But the fact that he is unfit. Now, Liazau is a problem. Risky, on you come, son. Fitness level's not great there. Anyone else? Probably too many. But have we got another midfielder? Nicholas, on you come. A shout of Demand More, Zanyu, Livermento. 12 minutes or so to go. Makoko, he beats Arian B. <laughs> Makoko! Oh, Jim. Oh, my goodness me. I just think we've seen the best goal of the save yet. Makoko beats Arian B. And what a goal that is. Gee whiz. <sighs> Blown away. Right. Attacking. Hopefully that isn't just a little uh, caveat to say, yeah, there's your goal. Ten minutes to go. You ain't having nothing else. Livermento to Gavi. We've got all these players on the pitch now. Makoko's in. <laughs> Makoko wants to show us what he can do. He heard me, didn't he, Jim? I think he must have heard me as well because that is a wonder couple of goals. My goodness me. Gavi, round the corner to De Gouvier. De Gouvier through ball. And you ain't catching him. That is cracking. Lovely, lovely stuff. Right, what can we do with the instructions? One second. We have just up the pass in slightly and defending a bit wider and just see if that helps in anything. Now, fire up. Five minutes to go. Can we get a winner? See this game out. But it's Arsenal with the highlight. Makoko picks up the ball. Gets it again. Oh, I thought he's going to score a hat-trick of just absolute wonder goals then. But no. Ten shots to their four. They've not hit the target once. It's going to go to extra time unless we can hit one. Or are Arsenal going to do a sting in the tail? Neither at the moment. Come on, lads. 
Makoko again. Makoko, the Makoko show. Hadrea, Hadrea's in. Oh, <laughs> oh my word. He really is putting a show on for the cameras today. Goodness me. Nicholas now. Nicholas to Sardinia. Inside to Nicholas again. Richter. Anel. Final kicks of the game. Until we get to extra time, that is. Nicholas, what was that, son? <sighs> um, <sighs> yeah. <laughs> oh, my word. It is extra time. We do get an extra sub. Let's have a quick look. Oh, my goodness me. Liveramento or Gavi or De Gouvier or Hedrea, Hedrea, actually. Go on. We'll bring on Adam Ida. He can have a little run up there. Change has gone through. Fresh legs up front. And we'll see what he can do because he is the big lad. He can do things out of nothing. Let's drop back to a balanced mentality as well. To Gouvier, Makoko, out to Livermento. Livermento, down that right-hand side, beats his man, cross in. Ida's been pulled down for a penalty. Surely, Makoko on a hat-trick in the semi-final. It's got to be a penalty. The big man, yes, indeed. Makoko with a penalty. <laughs> We're into the final, boys. Oh, yeah, Jim. Well, don't go saying anything too soon. There's still plenty of this game to go. Makoko with a fine strike. Lovely jubbly. Yes, don't go saying anything too sudden. We are on that balance mentality. We're going to do a focus with 10 minutes to go. They are delighted. Nearly all of them. It's strange that Makoko's only on a 9.7, even though he's got a hat trick. Bit of an odd one. But we'll take this all day long. Thank you very much. What a turnaround. Well done. Great comeback in the second leg. Makoko on form. Books off spot at Wembley. Fitness concerns. Makoko leaves us purring. Trouble is, he doesn't do it every game now, does he? Latix inspired. And we'll play Newcastle in the final. So that should be a nice one at Wembley. Lovely. Tottenham game's being rearranged for it. Fair enough. So we played the whole game off camera. 20th in the league, 4-1, comprehensive victory. Hadrea, Makoko with two, and Gavi. Just didn't fancy playing it on the ca on camera. It just it was one of those games of what hull. Nah, we're going to play Chelsea next. Three days time. And here we go for the Chelsea game. Quarter in goal. Ellitson, Anel, Liazau and Richter. Yes, we've had to rest a few players. <laughs> Shaughnessy, Nicholas, De Gouvier, Tuomeni, Hedrea and Makoko up top. Unfortunately, it's against Chelsea and I'm... Mm, yeah, we'll see. Pick up where you left off last time out. That should do it. Come on. Right, let's sort Chelsea out. Liazau. Tuomeni. Makoko. Moving through the gears. He's starting to start off again. Like he should do. There's more interest in him as well. Arsenal are interested. There's a few other clubs interested as well. It just seems to be that time of the year. With it being January transfer window, people are trying to find a bargain. But they ain't having no bargain here. We ain't selling him cheap. Simple as that. Right. Makoko. De Gouvier. Shaughnessy. Forward. De Gouvier. Chouameni. Makoko's onside. Beautiful stuff. Come on. That will do us. Jim. Jim's here. Referee's fine. The goal is awarded. He did look onside. De Gouvier to Shaughnessy. Round the corner. Tuameni. Beautiful stuff. Makoko. Lovely finish. Thank you very much, Jim. Coming a bit soon that time. I know you're keen, but my word. Come on, boys. Three minutes on the clock. Lovely, lovely start. Even with a few changes, we still seem to be doing all right. So, fingers crossed that will stay that way. But it is Chelsea who hit back on 11 minutes. Ingarnala is having a bit of a dance and a jig in the corner. Anel, not the fittest player on the world out there today. Courtois to Makoko. 
Makoko to a Hadrea. Hadrea! Into the knees of Koble. Always someone at the doorbell when you don't need it. Corner again to Wigan. Right. De Gouvier with the corner. In far post. Leazal's there but doesn't quite make enough of it. 20 minutes coming up to Ellotson. Not had a lot of football of late, but uh, in today, alongside Anel, so that should help him. Ellotson, who was golden boy, Hadrea. Anel moving into midfield, Shaughnessy, Chiuameni. Miko goes in. Oh, Koble makes the save. For Farmer, still playing for Chelsea here. Havertz as well there. Ellotson now, down that right-hand side. Beats one. Gets it to Hadrea. Hadrea into Shaughnessy. Ellotson's continued his run. And there is Makoko. Lovely stuff, Jim. What a player this Ellotson is. He is absolutely fantastic. Look, he didn't stop running. Carried on his run. Cuts inside. Ball across. Open net, literally. Lovely stuff. That's what we like to see. Come on, boys. 20 minutes gone. Second in the league beyond Arsenal, who are currently five points clear. I know it's crazy. Arsenal are absolutely flying so far this season. Not what we want to see. Courtois. Liazau. Rushed into it. Havertz, though. Shaughnessy gets the ball off him. De Gouvier to Makoko. Too many. Back to Richter. Richter now. Down that left-hand side. Beats one. Makoko. He loses the ball to Fafana. That's not ideal. But Makoko is back in. Trying to win the ball back. So that's good news for him. The lad McLean. In the centre of the park for Chelsea. We have had a look at him a couple of times. Kai Havertz is in. But it's wide. Obviously Courtois up against his old team today. I forgot that one. So that's an interesting one in itself. What a ball by Mount. I was offside, I was going to say. <sighs> that was one hell of a pass. Liverpool down to third. Chelsea currently 12th in the league. Don't know what's going on with some of these teams. Ellotson now with a throw to Nicholas. Tries to drive the ball forward to, Nich to Ellotson, but doesn't quite do it. And now to Ellotson. Seeing a lot of the ball in this game. Hadrea's beaten his man. He's through on goal. Bearing down on goal. <laughs> There's only one outcome. Hakeem Hadrea. Lovely stuff. Jim. Absolutely fantastic. Ellotson involved again. You cannot keep the boy down. He is flying in this game. Just showing that Livermento. We have got someone else who can play. If you're not playing well. Yes, I agree with that assessment, Jim. Absolutely fantastic. Just what's required today. And here we are again. 3-1 up. Havertz winning the ball up against Anel. That's not what you'd like to see. Adrea coming back with him. And Makoko picking up the loose ball. Can we make it four before half-time? No. But I think we're doing well. But we're capable of more. That is a great shout absolutely great Anel to Gouvier there's a few of them that are going to need to come off have a bit of a rest Nicholas not playing all that well in there either not ideal so we'll go in in a minute and have a little look what we can do McLean Fafana Kante but Chiuameni wins the ball back Makoko all oh, McLean's off that's going to be a second yellow for McLean Jack McLean. Naughty boy. Three changes made. Anel gets a rest. So does Gouvier and Chiumeni. Liveramento playing central defence. Who would have seen it coming? Gavi and Risky comes on as well. So three changes made. Half an hour of football left. Balance mentality. Richter to Shaughnessy. Richter down that left hand side. Six foot five left back. Fantastic. Hadrea trying to get there. Nicholas into Risky. Risky now. Ball in. Makoko. Beautiful stuff. 
Jim. Absolutely fantastic header by Makoko. The flan, the flans, the fans are going nuts. Absolutely beautiful. Nicholas into Richter turns his man, gets the cross in, and Makoko with a half diving header. Yes, I can see what you mean, Jim. Beautiful stuff. 4 1 to the good against Chelsea now. Absolutely wonderful. And we're back to seven points behind Arsenal. Arsenal are beating Leicester, that's why. But, yeah, I don't get why they're so far ahead. I suppose it's because they've won 17 games of football, probably, James. That's the reason why they are absolutely dominant at the moment. Ellison to Risky. Risky back to Livramento. Lovely combination down that right-hand side now. Risky. Back out to Leazow. Not really a central defender either. Shaughnessy. Makoko. Gavi. Hadrea. That would have put the cherry on the icing. On top of that cake. 18 shots. 14 on target. XG of 2. 3.04. Unbelievable. Against Chelsea as well. Fan jolly tastic. Makoko with a 10 out of 10. That's what we like to see. Glorious win. Lovely. Wigan turned dominance into victory against Chelsea. Makoko on form. Beautiful. We're going to play the next couple of games to Forest and Villa off camera and then come back for that FA Cup. Well, here we are back in. We've done our January transfer window and we haven't spent any money. We've got no money to spend, as we can see here. Yeah. We're £165,000 over our wage budget. Transfers for the end of the transfer window nobody in just a few loans out that was it nothing not even an offer for any of the boys that are interested in going so all in all we're stuck with what we got let's go and play Sutton United so on the old schedule we're on a good run again we've changed back to the 4-1-3-2 narrow and it's just working beautifully Forest 3-0 victory Villa 3-0 victory things are back to normal Sutton United today. Let's go and play. And the team to play Sutton United. We've changed things up. In fact, John Scott's going to go in goal. Go on. We'll give the youngster a run. Scott in goal. Ellitson, Zanyu, Richter, Aterio, Lizau, Nicholas, Santos de Gouvier. Yeah, he's got to play. And Chiumeni, Risky, and Mara up top. So all the big boys are on the bench. We'll see how we get on at Sutton. And we're over at Sutton as well. This will be a bit of a wake-up call for them today, I think. Pump the fists. The fans expect a win. Don't let them down. That's the way to go. Here we are at Sutton. This is going to be an interesting one. We haven't seen a small stadium for... Ever? I think in this save? I think it's been... Yeah, I don't think we have. I think the smallest would have been like a championship team. I don't think... I don't remember playing anyone lower league even in the FA Cup or anything like that. So this will be an interesting one, to say the least. Alan Armstrong in charge of Sutton United. Sutton have got Hutton in the book. Sorry. <laughs> oh, behave, James, for goodness sake. Yes, if you're going to start, you're going to start. You're going to get into big trouble. Jim, you can do one. Right, it wasn't a goal. I don't know why Jim pressed the bu button for the goal. Maybe he's preempting something. Aterio, Richter, Richter, back in to Nicholas, forward to Mara. Mara, it is bucketing down here. Look at this ground. It's actually got the corner filled in. That is fantastic. Not down there. They've got the old radio mast or something down in that corner. Nicholas, to Zanyu. Ellitson, Nicholas, Risky, Risky, back to Ellitson. Where's he going? Nicholas, back to Risky again. Ellitson in, Mara hits the post. I think he was offside anyway, so it wouldn't have counted, but yeah. They are trying. i got to say it. Sutton are giving us a bit of a game here. If 35 minutes in, we're going to fire the boys up. Leazow to Nicholas. We certainly wouldn't want to replay. That would just be crazy. Aterio. Too many. To Richter. Zanyu. 
Nicholas, come on, lads. It's all right knocking the ball around. But let's get forward. Come on. Leah's out. Nicholas, to Risky. Risky. Risky's in. He's at the post now. Unbelievable. Right, instructions. We are going to change those full backs onto wing backs on defend to attack. And where's the other one? Aterio. We'll do him as well. Aterio, you need to be on attack, man. Get forward. That was totally unacceptable. That's the way to go. Nil-nil at half time with Sutton. Sort of uh, says it all really at the moment, doesn't it? Not very good. Aterio puts the ball in. Nicholas. De Gouvier. Out to Ellitson. Ellitson now. Gets it back to Nicholas. Ellitson. He's onside. To the byline. Nicholas in. De Gouvier. It's over the bar. The longer this goes on, the more I'm starting to get a bit of a squeaky bum. Now, we're all playing well other than Risky. Hopefully that means he's going to get a goal. Aterio. No, it's Mara. With the headband. Mara hits the wall. De Gouvier. To Nicholas. Where are you going, son? Where are you going? Puts it back to Leozau. Ellitson now. Down that right-hand side. Beats his man. Gets to the byline. Crosses it in. Risky. Mara! I think it is a goal because there's no VAR here, is there? No, that is correct. There is definitely no VAR at Sutton. Look at it, they've got shipping containers down there. Concentrate on the game, Jim. Risky, Tamara, he's offside, but we're not going to say anything. Oh my goodness me, that's embarrassing. It was offside, but no VAR. Hey-ho. Right, many. off you come, son. Have a break for Gavi in there. And I think Zan Yu as well. If we've got a defender on the bench, we have Anels there. He can come on. Aterio. 20 minutes to go. Mara puts through De Gouvier. De Gouvier. Three times in. He's scored on the rebound. Jim. I'm not quite sure what happened, but at least Jim is here to find out what happened. Gavi into Mara. De Gouvier hits the post. And it comes straight back to him. Oh, what a nightmare. The defender on the floor. The captain, is he as well? Not quite sure. Santos de Gouvier. You can come off as well, son. Four. Hmm. No, we won't bring him off. We'll bring Risky off. For Adam Ida. 15 minutes for Ida to play out there. And have a little bit of a run. Risky into Mara. It's a penalty. Is that Ida straight away? No, it's De Gouvier. De Gouvier slots it away to make it three. Jim. Yes, it's uh, it's starting to open up now. The game is away from Sutton United. With a beautiful penalty by De Gouvier. Yes, I think you need to... Stop trying to speak in a foreign language, Jim. It doesn't become you. As it stands at the moment, this isn't too bad. Oh, nearly, nearly. 3-0. It's not a battering, but we've certainly nearly let them score. Scott, what are you clapping for, son? 27 shots we've had. They've had three Next year, 3.34. Sort of says it all, really. A game that we have dominated, but not really shined. And there we are. 3-0 victory. Let's say it's a win. Scott, look, you're demotivated, son. You got thrown in last minute. Comfortable win for the Latics. De Gouvier, classy in front of goal. Right, three days and Spurs. And here we go for Spurs. Court iron goal, Livermento, Zanyu, Anel, Sardinia, Richter, Gavi, De Gouvier, Shaughnessy, Makoko and Hadrea up top. Here we go. Go out there and impress me. That is the shout. Shaughnessy looking aggressive. 
nice. Here we go. Fingers crossed today we can put three points onto that lovely total to go even closer to Arsenal. Liveramento with a bit of a dodgy throw, but he's got away with it. But it is a goal kick. Sardinia now, down that left-hand side. Hedrea, Shaughnessy, Gavi, Richter. Lovely football again by Wigan Athletic. Arnell, Shaughnessy. So comfortable on the ball. Hedrea. Sardinia coming down that left. Shaughnessy forward to Makoko, but the ball is cleared away. Shaughnessy gets it back, though. Sardinia beats his man into the left. Oh, the goalkeeper bats it away. And here we go with that crazy goal line technology that nobody understands. I don't get it. Rich just booked up a book in. That's not good. Oh, Courtois, what are you doing, son? He's gone wandering over. A shout of encourage. Come on, boys. That's not acceptable. We've had all the play. And we go and let Spurs back into it. Pushes them up to fifth place currently. Liveramento frustrated. But they are all composed now. De Gouvier. Oh, San Yu. Should be burying them ones. That is a chance gone begging. Come on, lads. Sardinia gets the ball in. Gavi. Santos to Gouvi. Yeah. <laughs> what a strike, son, Jim. Oh, my goodness me. He does pull these out the bag every so often, doesn't he? Richter to Shaughnessy. Gavi to Gouvier. Little one, too. Rolls it back to him. And straight in the postage stamp. It is right in top bins. Oh, my word. One all. That's more like it. Spurs back down to seventh. Lovely jubbly. Liveramento to Makoko. Gavi, Liveramento, back to Gavi. What's he going to do? He's going to give it to Hedrea, who has buried the header. But what is the referee doing? Jim, I think it's a goal, son. The goal has been awarded. Liveramento gets the ball to Makoko. Gavi to Liveramento. Gavi puts the cross in and Hedrea, not even a question of being offside. Miles on. Completely agree, Jim. Don't even know why they were looking at it. 2-1 to the good. That's more like it. Four points behind Arsenal now. Spurs down to eighth with that. That is absolutely fantastic news. Right. Half time is here. Gavi. Yes, we think we're capable of more. That's the way forward. Come on, lads. We've got more. we've got another gear. That is definite. Shaughnessy looking aggressive and one of the worst ratings on the pitch. Liveramento back to Gavi. Richter on that booking as well. He's probably one to come off in a minute. Santos de Gouvier. Gavi. Anel. Richter into Makoko. Santos de Gouvier. <laughs> we just put another one top pins. Jim. He's just unreal, this lad. Absolutely unbelievable. An L to Richter. Makoko round the corner to De Gouvier, and he just belts it in the top bins. I don't know what the goalie's doing. It's absolutely fantastic. 3 1 up now. Lovely, lovely stuff. Sardinia to Hedrea. Shaughnessy. Forward, Hedrea. He's in now. Oh, but he's missed. Fluffed his lines. Smashes it wide. Right, let's make some changes. Three changes made. Leazal, Chiumeni and Nicholas on for Anel, Richter and Shaughnessy. Right, half an hour to go. 3-1 to the good. This just helps with that goal difference as well a little bit. We're still nine behind Arsenal. They have had a fantastic season. Crazy, absolutely crazy. 20 minutes to go now. It's just, I don't get what Arsenal are doing. They're just battering everyone in sight currently. 
they are playing tomorrow as it stands so hopefully they can slip up Huracan Sion Chu it's a, it's a big old team they've got here actually Emerson Royale and Zanyu cuts out the ball gets it to Liazau Sardinia to Nicholas Liazau lovely football again from Wigan Libramento down that right hand side into Gavi just keeping the ball it's great to see too many oh, it's just if we get a goal from this it's just unreal and here we go Makoko's in <laughs> how many passes for his 30th goal of the season Jim it just said a superb team goal Liazau to Zanyu and there it is what a ping that is beautiful pass and Makoko with the finish Yes, reminded me of a young, I can't even remember what he's called. What's the boy at Liverpool called? Gone. It's gone. Sammy Hippier, that's the one. Pinging balls around, beautiful player he used to be. Absolutely unbelievable. But it is Tottenham trying to come forward. Adrea though, trying to get the ball back. But we do get it back. To Gouvier, Makoko's miles off. I'm not even going to put the flag up for this one. It, it didn't even bother. It's off. It's miles off. Yes, goal disallowed. It stays at five. Four. Five. What? Why did it even change? Doesn't normally, does it? Sardinia loses the ball. Pinto gets the ball taken off in by Nicholas lovely seconds to go and it's just playing out for a Spurs highlight I don't know why they've been absolutely battered today we have hammered them and here we go again Nicholas now it's showing a highlight of that crazy offside I don't know sometimes lovely stuff 4-1 Great win for us. Lovely, lovely. Santos de Gouvier again picks up a beautiful man of the match. Run carries on. This is more like it. You can see we're just a great team again. Well, and after that great performance, why change anything? Quarter, Livermento, Zanyu, Anel, Sardinia, Richter at the base, Gavi, Santos de Gouvier, Shaughnessy, Makoko and Hadrea up top. Let's go and play Man City. Just noticed that Didier Deschamps is in charge now. Don't let me down. Carry on as you left off. Didier Deschamps is now Manchester City manager. It's just unbelievable. Haaland now with a free kick. And Courtois didn't even move. Anel. Forward to Sardinia. Sardinia coming down that left-hand side. Loses the ball to Chiesa though. That's not ideal. Come on lads. This lot are in ninth in the league. Haaland. To Dylan Khan. We tried signing him a couple of times. Gavi wins the ball. Makoko now. Coming down that right hand side. Cuts back into Gavi. To Gouvier. To Gouvier. Carrying on that form. <laughs> it's beautiful to watch. Santos to Gouvier. Jim. Oh, it is beautiful. We break so quick. Gavi to De Gouvier. Ball to Hedrea. Gets it back. And lovely stuff. Fantastic, in fact. I, I'm i purring with this team at the minute. It, we have found our little mojo again, and we are off and running. It is just beautiful. As long as we can keep it together. We don't want to go too gung-ho and go silly. But as it stands at the moment, see, now that's not good enough. Unless we're going to win this ball back. Ruben Diaz been booked for City at centre half. That's an interesting one. I think we're going to win this ball, aren't we? We're going to have this ball back, aren't we? Please, ref. Chiesa. Oh, goodness me. That is some strike. A shout of encourage. Come on, boys. That is not what we want today. Not a goal like that. Not in the slightest. And now booked as well. They both got booked at the same time. I wonder if it was a bit of a, a something going on there. 
Sardinia to Shaughnessy. He's been booked as well now. Gavi, back to an L. Shaughnessy. Gavi, Shaughnessy, lovely football. Makoko's in. That's got to be a goal. It's got to be a goal. Lovely stuff. Jim, I just had a sneaking suspicion it might have been offside, but the ball sort of came over the top and everybody just missed Makoko's run and he just put it in the corner. It's a beautiful finish. A beautiful goal. Stunning stuff. We take the lead again against Manchester City in a strong wind with drizzle. Nine degrees. Here we are in February 2029. Yes, here we are a few years into the future now. The defence is not playing at his best. Sardinia on a 6.5 and Anel on a 6.5 as well. Not perfect by any stretch of the imagination. Liazal, he might be coming on soon. Half time. I think I'm disappointed with the little possession we've had. Even though we are at the old Etihad, we still should be doing a bit better in my eyes. They're ninth at the end of the day. We should be doing a lot better. Sardinia, off you come, son, for Gabriel Aterio. He's nervous, but hey-ho, Livermento's just picked up a booking as well. So off you come for Ellitson. And we've got one more change in the bag, which I think will be an L for Liazau. Because he's been playing so great when coming on in that role. He is an exceptional player. Gaia, a 5.9. A shout of focus with 15 minutes to go. They're single-minded and focused and raring to go. Only Shaughnessy still on the pitch with a card for us. I'm just hoping that that's not going to be an issue. They've taken Gaia off, actually, on a 5.9. But three more fabulous points in the bag, he says. Maybe not too soon. Get in there. Great win at the Etihad. Again, just shows you the form we are in. Four-point gap between us and Arsenal. Arsenal are relentless. They don't stop winning. Ignore the praise. You're becoming complacent as they criticise us. Don't let that happen. They're motivated. I'm not quite sure what that meant, but yeah. Citizens brushed aside by Inform. Fantastic team. That is Wigan Athletic. Seven days and we've got Leeds. And they're up in fifth. So that's an interesting one. Well, finally, Nalapo is back from international duty where he's rattled up a whole ton of caps and a whole ton of goals. 42 appearances now, 23 goals at the age of 20 years old. Just phenomenal. But today, oh, we missed the team. Hang on a minute. Courtois, Livermento, Zanyu, Anel, Sardinia, Richter, Gavi, De Gouvier, Shaughnessy, Makoko, Hadrea. You know the team. It is Leeds United. It's a win we, game we should be winning. Make sure we do. It is Leeds United. So come on. The boys are ready. And it's a kickoff highlight for Wigan Athletic. Shaughnessy. We have said that we should be winning this. So whether this is a bit of complacency, we're going to lose the ball and not score. Or Hadrea's in. Oh. And nearly in the opening 25 seconds, we've nearly scored a goal. Hakeem Hadrea. But Zanyu, 50 seconds, should have had two. Well, we wouldn't have had two, but you know what I mean. Fourth. Currently leads our fourth in the league. That is crazy. Arsenal, 3-0 again. Look, they just... Oh, Sean, he's taken a knock. He needs to come off. Yes, we're going to do that. We're not going to risk him. A shout of encourage. Come on, lads. We've got PSG next. So we don't want to go messing up now. We need to get involved. Let's get positive. Let's get on top of this game. And let's get some goals, please. And thank you. Santos de Gouvier on a 6.5. Is somebody man-marking him? They are playing with a 3 in there. And they have still got Calvin Phillips, who is 33 years old. Probably man-marking him. That's not ideal. Bjorn Arnson as well. Another one. Pretty quick, pretty good. And it is that midfield of Leeds that do come away with the ball. 
Now, come on. That's offside. That's offside, but we do clear it so it doesn't count. Gelhart is injured for them as well. I noticed that he did have an injury. It is half time. That totally unacceptable. Totally unacceptable. Gavi, Santos de Gouvier, Hadrea, sort yourselves out because two of you will be coming off. I've already made one sub, so I can't make any more than two. But we're going to lose ground again if we don't pick up. Come on, lads. Gelhart, who is injured, like we said. Courtois picks up the loose ball. Rolls it to an L. Sardinia. Back into an L. Lovely football, hopefully. Courtois pumps the ball forward. Adrea, nowhere near that. And it's an injured Gelhart who's put the ball in. And Ribeiro, I'm hoping the linesman and referee are sorting something out here. Goal's given. The goal has been awarded. That is a beration. And Santos de Gouvier, off you come, son. Nicholas is in there. Zanyu back to Courtois. Half an hour to go. Plenty of time to make a change to this game. An L. Forward again. Hadrea. Makoko's in. Makoko onto that left foot, but Kepper makes the save. Kepper in goal. My word. Gavi. Another one not playing good enough. And it will be Leazal. On you come, son. This is just three. All three midfielders have been changed now. Let's go attacking. Let's have a shout of demand more, fire up, that sort of business. They are fired up. They are ready and raring. This is not acceptable. Can we make one more quick little shout? Five minutes to go. Beration. Come on, lads. Before Champions League as well, as per usual. Now, Leeds have the highlight, but does that mean anything these day and age? Robinho's through again. He's hit the woodwork. Ball's pumped forward. Leazau, Nicholas, forward. Hadrea can't quite get there. Kepa comes charging out of the area. Highlight still continues. Courtois to Livermento. Livermento. There's a minute left. Livermento down on that side. Makoko to the byline. Puts the ball in. Oh, unbelievable. I cannot understand how this highlight is still going. Why have you got Leas out? Why have you gone back there? And now Zanyu forward. Makoko's offside. But Livermento's got the ball. It's all about phases now. Unbelievable. Livermento is just dawdling along. Come on. Makoko. Leazau. Makoko into the box. Makoko can't get it. And it is ends in defeat. We've been playing so well. It's now seven point gap with Arsenal. Can be ten with that game in hand. Absolute shameful. Now PSG. One change. After a defeat, you've got to change something. So Sean is coming into the base. And Germany goes up into midfield. Richter drops out. So Courtois, Livermento, Zanyu, Anel, Sardinia, Shaughnessy, Gavi. He's got to perform today. Santos de Gouvier, Chiumeni, Makoko and Hadrea. And in fact, I'm going to switch them pair around as well. Pump the fists. Go out there and give the fans their money's worth. That is the one. They are motivated. Here we are at the DW. PSG. Pep Guardiola in charge of PSG. Of course he is. Oh, goodness me. Arsenal got Bayer Leverkusen as well. So hopefully, two English teams doing okay. Or, if we can have Bayer, I'll be happy with that. Ten minutes in, not a shot anywhere. We're going to have a quick encourage as well. I'm not going to go too gun-ho against this lot. Hakimi, Mendes, Mikulisi's there as well, look. Varvic. Oh... It's a good team, but, you know, we are seven years in the future, eight years nearly, so it's it's a lot of change, other than Donnarumma and Hakimi. 
Oh, Goretzka's there as well, look. Oh, Joy, three shots apiece. We've not had a single shot. What's we have? One on target. Makoko's been booked. And Shaughnessy. Something's just gone on there in the 38th minute. Nobody's playing very well for us ish and they're not playing much better i'm going to say far from pleased that's the call and yeah the strikers aren't playing well at all we're going to do an early one i think we're going to go for mara there hadrea off as well for risky hadrea off for risky i know it's a highlight but we'll see what happens too many Sardinia, down that left-hand side, cuts inside, gives it to... He gets it back. He gets it back. He puts the cross in. Mara's on the pitch. Mara in. <laughs> Adrea. Oh, my goodness me. We're about to take him off. Jim. Yes, I think that was the second change. It was going to happen. Makoko is off and Mara's on. That one went through. But Hadrea is still there. Whether they still thought he was off the pitch, I don't know. Yeah, I'm not quite sure myself. No, we won't make that change now. But too many, we will make that change. And we'll bring on Nicholas. We've got one more change in the bag, which is Shaughnessy. That is for sure. Richter on Newcomb. Because Shaughnessy on a 6.3 and a booking... This is a great way to go if we can last these last 15 minutes. Or are we going to get another one? Mara to Nicholas. Not quite sure where Nicholas was playing the ball then. I think that goes a long way to say that he hasn't really played a lot of football with Mara. But Nicholas there, standing up. Needs to do a bit more. Zakarian as well. Oh, has not. Of course they signed has not, didn't they? And here is Zakarian. Elise's in. Oh, and Courtois makes the difference. What a move that was by Paris Saint-Germain, it said. But thankfully, didn't end up with a goal. Right, 1-0 to the good. Maybe a quick focus. That has made them single-minded and focused. So that's great news, other than one player. Now, Donnarumma pumps the ball forward. Mara... We get it back to Gouvier. Mara's in! Oh, goodness me. I was about to go. I was about to go. And now my cat is here for the first time on camera. Oh, this is great. Absolutely unbelievable. Whether you can hear the cat, I'm not sure. And what's gone and happened? It's offside. Got to be offside, ref. That was offside. The referee's blown his whistle. Goals awarded? Billy, that's your fault. Has not. At the far post. Courtois come out flapping. They all said offside, but unfortunately, in the last minute, PSG have got an equaliser. Expect to see you in training tomorrow. Not happy. Not happy at all. And now I can see a yellow card, which is Shaughnessy is going to miss the next game. Shaughnessy's ruled out of the next round. Yes, it's a bit of a blow, but we'll have to see how we can do. Now, looking at what's going on, and time-wise, we're going to knock it on the head there. That means the EFL Cup final will be the first game back in the next episode. Well, boys and girls, what drama. Last seconds just drives you to despair, doesn't it? Has not. Has scored. Didn't has not. But please do like, subscribe, and get notified of future uploads to the Wigan Athletic YouTube channel and please get up to Tix Gaming. What are you doing? And down below, comments on the video and also a little bit further down in description. Come over and see the Preset channel. Please and thank you.